Jason with Revolution U at RevYourWeek.com and also an independent team beach body coach. And today I'm going to talk about how to have a fit club. As you are getting into coaching at with Team Beachbody, you no doubtly want to not only grow your business, but also, you know, we got to keep centered what our primary mission is, and that is to end the trend of obesity in this country. And not only that, but I really even feel around the world. So as you are launching out into this, one of the prime ways you want to be able to end the trend and also boost your business is to begin a fit club. And so today I'm gonna take you through some of the ins and outs. Uh, we've been Team Beachbody for a little while now and we just uh, started our fit clubs and they are already doing awesome. The first weekend we had almost 20 and now we the, the last one we just did had about 13. And so it, you know, it has, it's just like anything else, a little bit of highs, a little bit of lows. And, but it's a great way to be able to, again, boost your business and go out and uh, end this trend. So I wanna cover just a few things of how to have a fit club. And one of the first things you want to do is secure a location. And there's all kinds of ways you can, can secure a location. For, you know, first you're gonna have to find one. Uh, what I would say is, is the first place to look is your own living room. Maybe having some friends over and just start working out with them once a week. Have that fit club, and but you might say, "Hey, I've got a bigger vision, man. I wanna, I wanna have lots of people." So there's plenty of places to be able to do that. Maybe you have a local community center, or maybe even a school will let you utilize their facility for a short time. Uh, maybe a co uh, a church, church might be able to do that. Um, you know, maybe a, another business of a friend that you know that might have a good sized room, uh, a hotel room, you know, a hotel meeting room. Uh, there's all kinds of places. You just gotta put your mind to it and, and get out, get on the lookout, and then just meet with them and tell them what you're doing and, and see what you can work out. We actually started in a local community center that is kind of right by our house. And it had just a big sized room and we were, we were able to secure that once a week and, and we just went for it. So that's the first thing you wanna secure a location and then once you got that location you want to start promoting and that's why I think having your Facebook uh, going you can do a Facebook event and and invite all of your friends and, and push it out on your own Facebook on Twitter and, and just start getting it out and the other thing you want to do to promote it is to make some flyers and put them up around the area go to a local fire station or go to businesses and hand them out and just tell them what you're doing and be excited and promote 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 don't just throw it up one time or throw up one event invite and hope that everybody remembers you need to be actively promoting you want to grow your fit club you want to see many people coming and, and getting fit and getting healthy each and every week so you've got to promote you, you so you got to secure your location and then you got to begin to promote and then let's take it up to the night or equipment that you're going to need here's some of the equipment that you're going to need uh, we actually take this tv that you can see right here behind me we take that each and every week we have a dvd player and i have a computer hook them all up and and i, I have uh, announcement kind of things rolling beforehand playing little uh, clips of the workout programs and on the computer and then when it's time to work out just throw it in the DVD and we push play because that's really what we do at home and so I'm just showing really everybody that's there just how simple it is you know at home same thing that we're doing just put it in your DVD player uh, our many great workouts and you just hit play and that's it and so you're gonna need a TV or a projector if you want to go out and buy a projector and get a screen you can do that uh, then you're going to have to have some, some of your product there. Uh, if you've got several of the workouts, have them laid out on a table. Have a, you're going to have a sign-up table and have that laid out. Uh, you, you're going to need the waivers and, and the sign-up forms that you can get in your back office. And so you need to have all this stuff, have some product out, have all that, have a little you know, equipment table, and then depending on what work you, you're going to have. Uh, I always encourage everybody, just you know, if you're going to do a fit club, 
Just try to do the ones that don't require equipment. That way anybody can walk in at any moment and know that they can get a good workout. In fact, you know, this one guy came in uh, last night and he's like, where's all the weights? I, I, wanted to do, I wanted to do weights. And I'm like, hey, you know, we never know who's going to walk in. And, you know, we'd have to have weights for 20, 30 people. And so uh, that's it. You just never know who's going to walk in the door. And you want to be able to be able to service every single one that's there. So you got to secure your location. You got to have uh, your equipment. You got to be promoting. And then it comes to the night of the event. You want to get there a little early. Get there about 30 minutes to an hour set up, depending on how fast you can get all that set up. You want to be ready to go about 15 to 20 minutes before uh, you kick off working out because people are going to come in early, start stretching, warm up, and you want to not be setting all your stuff up. You want to be welcoming them all in there, uh, taking them over to your table, having them sign in, filling out that waiver, which is very important, and, and just creating a fun atmosphere for the night. Exciting and, and, and just already be not, not in major promotion mode, but letting them know who you are and letting them know what you are doing as well and that you're there just to help them however that they need it. And so get there a little early and you know about 20, uh, 20 minutes, you wanna be all set up, have everything out. Uh, I, I, if you have other coach or partner or your, your spouse is doing it with you, you know, have one of you work you know, at the table, being able to sign up and, and another coach you know, welcoming everybody in there. And then about maybe five minutes before you wanna kick off into your workout, it just welcome everybody. Just grab everybody's attention. Just let them know, hey, how you doing tonight? We're gonna have just an awesome workout. We're so glad that you're here. I'm Jason, I'm a, I'm a Beachbody coach, and we're just here to help you in any way that we can. And also, we want you just to have a great, great, fun, exciting workout. These are some of the workouts that we all do at home, and we're gonna just get right into it. But I want you to watch a short video right before we get going. And then you're gonna play that pre-workout DVD. And, and that's important because it kind of just tells everybody what's going on a little bit and just kind of warns them, hey, just, just if, if you're going too hard, make sure you stop. And that's, that's important to go. And then just launch. Then it's time to just push play. And if you're a coach, man, I encourage you, uh, don't be standing around, don't be walking around, be active. Get in there and work out. Get in the front and set the tone and work out hard you know show them uh, that that you can lead by example you don't want to be sitting off and watching everybody you want to be out there actively working out enjoying yourself smiling having fun and just getting after it and then after your workout what we do is we just thank everybody for coming tell them that we got many of the products and if they have any questions that they can get them, uh, they can go over to our table over there or just ask us anything and we just thank them for being there that night. And, and that's pretty much it, you know, that's, that's your fit club and I, I just wanna encourage you, if, if you're doing this, you know, just find your location and just go for it. I mean, so many people think it's got to be perfect, but you know, it, you wanna have it as great as you can but it doesn't have to be totally, totally perfect. But you want to cut out any kind of distractions that you can and, and make sure that, man, your first impression when somebody comes in is, is that you are excited, you are, you are you're healthy, and, and you just love what you're doing. And then just promote. Don't forget to get those email addresses, get uh, their, their contact advice. Uh, contact information that way you can follow back up with them send them out things when we have promotions going and, and continue to invite them out each and every week and then, and then I would say uh, up, up on all of this is just challenge them to come back you know don't forget to challenge them to come back and to begin to lead this healthy lifestyle so that's that's kind of how we do a fit club and I just want to encourage you go for it just go for it and you will see that we're gonna start ending this trend of obesity in this country. So thank you, you guys have a great week and, and let's just go for it.